to be able to get the result. The money also continuing in the corner of Cast. He's been racing well at Duke Group 2 level the past couple. Coming out also of the Let's Elope 2. Didn't seem to get the room last start. Now on the eight day backup and his horse is loading. It's time for the listed Seymour Cup for this year. Who's going to take it out? Terry, we welcome you back in. What a wonderful feature to be able to have here on the country card. It's just a, a great track. It's played beautifully. It's a really good lineup for the cup. Cast the favourite went out way before the other runner. She's a moody galloper. Hasn't won for some time. Midnight Blue G looked in great order. The stable presented him beautifully. Lovely, big, strong horse. Jimmy Hendricks to move in. Grand Slam. There's a few that haven't won for a while that have been group performers turning the clock back. Second to none for Damien Lane. The South Australian runs the favourite at five dollars. The starter wanders over to his platform. The line is complete. Midnight Blue in, and they're ready to run for this year's edition of the Bet365 Seymour Cup. Cracking day. They stand. Started not quite ready. Now he hits the button, they're off. Hell hath no fury and second to none drop back. And in particular, Jimmy Hendricks going out to last. Mac 2 began quickly with Foxy Cleopatra. Midnight Blue, Earlswood going up. Boy, oh boy, it's a battle for the front. Just off them, back towards the inside then is Hell Hath No Fury improving. And don't doubt Dorian. There's Pounding taking off with Grand Slam. They're out of no man's land. They're followed by Carini. Two lengths away, cast Earl of Tyrone. Then second to none, Antrim Coast and Jimmy Hendricks. Boy, oh boy, there's a lot of action. The front runner is Earlswood. Grand Slam going up. Pounding third, Midnight Blue. Fourth. Mac Tube takes a drop. Foxy Cleopatra well positioned. They're followed by Carini. Hell hath no fury. Worse than centre field inside of Don't Doubt Dorian Cast. A length and a half Earl of Tyrone. Then second to none. Boy, he's got a lot of work to do. He's a mile back in the field from Antrim Coast. And Jimmy Hendricks whips them in. Earlswood setting a good speed. A half grand slam. 600 out. One away. Midnight blue. And then came pounding. Two lengths. Mac Tube coming around Carini and Foxy Cleopatra the centre. Hell hath no fury is going up, starting a run. Further back in the field as they turn the bend, then would have been Don't Doubt Dory. Second to none's a while back in the field and cast to the outside. Earlswood upon straightening, tackled by Midnight Blue. Midnight Blue race to the front, leads the way. Cast wide out, running on, so to Mac Tube. It's old Midnight Blue in front and he's going great guns. He's a length and a half. Earl of Tyrone flying Midnight Blue. Wins the cup by three quarters to a length. Earl of Tyrone second, third prize in the race, Mac Tube. Second to none, luckless cast wide out and Jimmy Hendricks late. They're followed by, behind them is Hell Hath No Fury, Earlswood pounding, then Grand Slam, Foxy Cleopatra, Carini Antrim Coast and Don't Doubt Dory. Well, he looked a million dollars in the yard, the big old boy, and at a price, he's pulled off a surprise. The great win. He was sent out of the gate aggressively by Daniel Stackhouse. He's an aggressive rider. He rides to win all the time, and he's got the best out of him. Earl of Tyrone has pinched.